An anonymous hacker is holding the coursework of Taranaki High School students to ransom. Hawera High School's entire network has been taken offline. The hacker is demanding $5,000 US dollars. Ben Irwin reports. It's not often millennials choose a textbook over tech, but these Hawera High School students have no choice. All the school's computers have been turned off since Monday morning after a hacker encrypted server files and asked for a ransom payment. What it was was um, 5,000 US dollars in Bitcoin. Principal Rachel Williams says the server housed some partially completed student coursework and teaching resources. So like our Word documents in Excel, etc., uh, they just looked blank. So they still looked like they were named the same thing um, and they had a little, in square brackets at the end, they had something else going on. The police cybercrime unit says the hacker used a known variant of ransomware malware and is still investigating how they gained access. Declan Ingram from the government's computer emergency response team says these attacks are carried out by opportunistic hackers who try to exploit out-of-date security software. We don't recommend that people pay the ransom. Um, there's no uh, guarantee that you'll get your files back if you do. Williams says a ransom won't be paid, with important files like student records safe after a recent migration to cloud-based storage. The Taranaki school's network won't be fixed until next week, leaving staff and students to educate the old-fashioned way until they can get back online. Ben Irwin, Newsub.